Hey guys, so I'm back with another foundation files, okay? So I will start the split screen now because I am not sure um, how long it actually took me to put on this foundation. So you're not seeing it in the camera, but these foundations, oh, what am I talking about? I'm, I Today I tried out um, Wet n Wild's foundation, um, photo finish foundation, okay? This was like a really big deal um, a couple months ago, maybe six months ago. Not sure when. Anyways, I picked them up then. I haven't used them just because I tend to gravitate towards my favorite foundations um, for day-to-day -day use. And one thing I hate, one thing I absolutely hate is having to mix to get my color. That is just, if I have to mix, most likely I'm not going to use the foundation just because I don't want the trouble of going through and mixing, okay? So um, being that it was getting a ton, a ton, a ton of good reviews or whatever, I said, let me go ahead and try um, this foundation. So I ended up going with 376C Coco. I don't know how this is Coco, but okay and then 378 c espresso okay so i'm assuming the c's and all all that jazz stand for cool and y'all know that i am a warm tone i have a lot of golden undertones a lot of um yellow um in my skin but this is what my walgreens had and the one that i went to i live in the houston area and so a lot of our Walgreens um, or CVS do not carry the darker foundations. I had to go all the way to the southwest side of town to that Walgreens and I ended up being there anyways. I was going to a movie theater over there. And so they, they had the um, foundation. So I ended up picking up there. They had the full range. Okay. And I do believe you can buy the full range now on um, Ulta and of course, Wet n Wild's website, okay? So I ended up going with um, these two colors, dotted them on my face, as you saw, and blending it out with my Real Techniques, it's dirty, <coughs> Real, Tex Real Techniques Beauty Sponge, okay? I set it with RMCA No Color Powder. Um, what I'm gonna start doing in these foundation files is using the RMCA No Color Powder for everything, um, just because, what you call it, it's just easier. Um, and the color the powder does not impart any color onto my skin So I can't be like well since this color was off it um, I used Laura Mercier or whatever to bring it up. You get what I'm saying? So it, it 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 just makes everything kind of like a clean slate. Okay, so This is the wear. I've actually had it on for an hour so far because I did have to film a video Y'all know how it is. I multitask if I'm doing one video I'm usually going to do three videos or two videos at least um, just because I pre-film everything so this eye look is coming up with one with um, the Ace Beauty uh, y'all I can't talk today uh, and I got uh, lipstick on my teeth mm. so this eye look is coming up with the Ace Beauty um, one, one palette series that I am currently doing or will do depending on when this video goes up okay so um, I'm gonna wear this foundation since I've had it on oh I've had it off for like two hours never mind had this foundation for about two hours um, I can tell you right off I don't think I like this foundation it doesn't have enough coverage for me I was putting it on and like I said I have acne marks this area you can still see this one right there um, I don't I don't know I don't too much care for it so far it did go on nicely um, once I blended it out I did once I set it I used the lighter color foundation um, under my eyes as a concealer and it's okay y'all it's okay I don't I'll see how it lasts I'm gonna wear this it is now 729 7 oh, Lord maybe if we can do this is now 729 I've had this on for since five o'clock so it's almost been um, <clears throat> two hours a little bit more than two hours 
So I'm going to wear this um, going out. So when I come back, hopefully I'll get at least eight hours wear. And we'll see how I think. I don't think this is going to last for eight hours. It, I, I set it and whatnot the way I usually do my foundation. My, uh, I set it and everything the way I usually do my foundations with um, a sealer spray, makeup sealer, which currently I'm using Cinema Secrets um, makeup sealer. So I did do that um, and we'll see how long it lasts. So I will come back um, again when it's, when I'm ready to take it off. All right, guys. Hey guys, so I am back and um, I've had this uh, foundation on, this makeup on for about eight hours. It is now 1.32, yeah, 1.32. And so, um, yeah. So just to refresh, what did I use? I used these two, maybe these two. I don't know. I want to say I used um, 376 and 377, these two. So just one qualm. <clears throat> this is 376, this is 377. I feel like there could be one shade in between these. Um, granted, Wet n Wild does have a lot of um, shades in this photo finish or photo focus um, foundation but I mean really we could have one more shade in between these two or whatever and so which is typically the case with um, drugstore foundations really foundations period for um, women of color um, on your darker end of, and then of course um, on the fair end for um, folks that have um, extremely light skin okay guys I'm getting sick and within the last eight hours I feel like it has taken over my throat so excuse how my voice sounds so um, eight hours worth of wear as you can see I'm pretty zoomed in let me see if I can get a little bit closer <laughs> ignore my lips Actually, my lips actually lasted pretty well. My lip line is crooked, though. <clears throat> but as you can see, um, I'm getting oily here, which is normal. And then um, a little cakeage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A little cakeage there. And I just got lipstick on my thing. And then again there it is breaking up a little bit <clears throat> in this area which is to be expected um everywhere else is actually looking pretty um pretty good so <clears throat> yeah it's wearing fairly well um in my areas that i am usually oily <clears throat> i mean i'm oily you know this area here um, is it breaking up on my nose let me look it's breaking up on my nose a little bit in my this area here so um, yeah it's okay I like the way it looks I like the way it looks but like I said I don't want to have to mix two foundations and this I had to mix right <clears throat> So that is a thumbs down um, as far as that. It's wearing okay. The only thing about it is since I do have to mix foundations, I'm, I'm not going to have the same color every single time unless I go in and um, <clears throat> depot these uh, foundations into another one of those pump containers that you can get on Amazon and mix a foundation shade there that's the only thing so it'll always always be a um a different color i won't ever get this same color i would have to match every single time which gets extremely 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 annoying so um other than that it didn't come into my laugh lines i see the start of it trying to get into my laugh lines and if i was to wear this <coughs> like on a full work day which is 12 hours not 12 hours but by the time I get home from time I put it on from t and the time I get home it's about 12 hours wear for me for a full work day I do believe that this would be in my laugh lines but overall it's an okay 
okay foundation and I mean it's $4.99 so <clears throat> you know would I go out and buy spend eight what eight ten dollars um, with tax and everything on this foundation since I will have to buy two of them um, sure why not um, does it replace another foundation in my arsenal um, no, just because my go-to drugstore foundation is, um, what is it? Maybe it's not go-to if I can't remember. Maybelline Fit Me, the matte Fit Me, right? And that foundation, I have a perfect match. I don't have to mix. It is awesome every single time. So no, this is not, these <laughs> do not replace um, one of my go-to's. But in a pinch, if I'm out, I put my makeup somewhere, I know that I can use this. And I mean, it looks good on camera. I mean, it looks really good. I like it. It looks good on camera, but it's just... I don't like having to mix foundations, y'all. I don't. So <clears throat> that's it. I'm going to pull these lashes off and take off all this makeup. <laughs> whatever so hope you enjoyed and yeah good foundation I would recommend it um, especially if you can find one that's your shade if not uh... all right so I will talk to you guys later bye